Hey YouTube, it's Alicia here. Hope everybody is having a great day. None other. I am coming to give y'all a all these, let me say it, a all these empty haul video. So yeah, so this is everything that I purchased from all these the other month. I just wanted to come and show you some of the things um, that I purchased and let you know what I would repurchase and what I won't repurchase. So without no further ado, let's get started. So we're going to start with the drink and it's by this brand called Pure Aqua and it's a black cherry sparkling water um black cherry flavored with other natural flavors this is zero calories listen to this y'all zero calories zero trans fat zero sodium and zero sugar this was the best thing that i got from there and i think this was no more than like 70 60 or 70 or 80 cent don't quote me on that, but I loved it. It is a 12 Florence ounce. So y'all, y'all can like, if I only brought one of these, this would probably will be a product I would repurchase. Let me hear me say it. This would be a product I would repurchase again from Aldi. So another thing I would repurchase from Aldi, and it is by the brand it's organic and it's uh, called simple natural non-gmo um excuse me cinnamon raisin granola cereal good source of fiber 16 grams of fat per serving and it has this on there no uh free of uh casserole i hope i pronounced that casserole free and thing it's only 220 calories um 0 0.5 trans fat 55 um sodium and only 15 sugars not bad and you could get a half cup a half cup per about six servings so what I would use this for, I would just use this as just, I won't use it as cereal. I use it as a snack and it's good. I love the taste. They come in several other flavors. They have a honey flavor. I think they also have a, it's one more, it's three flavors and all, but overall this is a pretty good one. And I can tell y'all this would be another um, purchase. Let me just say, this would be a repurchase. So we have two repurchases already. So let's talk about, um, yes. So we have to talk about this. This is called a Primo, Primo Mushroom Risotto Natural Artificial Flavor Authentic Italian um, imported from, um, Italy and this is um 300 and 330 calories 0 0.5 trans fat uh 90 um excuse me uh 790 of sodium and only four sugars and this is like one half cup per serving and stuff this is this and you can cook this on the stove or on the microwave I'll cook it in the microwave and you put it in a uh, microwave safe dish in cold water. You cook it between 15 to 17 minutes. And you can put um, two teaspoons. You can put Parmesan cheese in it or put two teaspoons of unsalted butter in it as well. So yeah, I did it without the butter and it still tastes good. This is a repurchase for me. I will say this. I, I am refining this. This is something I really want to go back and rebuy right here. So, yes. Now, I did get some fruit from there. I got some um, strawberries. I liked it, the strawberries. Um, if I could say anything, if I could say anything that the strawberries was 
pretty good. Another thing that I brought was the stuff uh, Abella mushrooms, um, Bella, small uh, Abella mushrooms. Those was pretty good. Um, you can cook them in the stove or in the air fryer. So I cooked the mines in the air fryer for about 15 minutes and they turned out good. That's a good um, dinner alternative. If you don't want to do a full on cook, full on meal, that is something I would recommend. But yeah. So another thing I picked up was the keto. It's called Love Love Loveland Fresh Keto Friendly um, Wheat Bread Vegan. No sugar, no added. And no added, and no added, and no and no added, no added sugar, and and it's gluten, and it's 35 calories. It's zero trans fat, 115 of sodium, and zero sugar. I tried this, and when I ate, when I had certain things for breakfast, I have a toast, and I will cut it in half for toast. And stuff, and I spread it with um, some um, avocado I already had, avocado mixed with honey um, mixture, and it tastes good with that. It was pretty good. So, another thing I picked up is the Lesser Ives. I hope I pronounced that right. And this is the popcorn, and it's the Himalayan pink salt popcorn with organic extra, extra virgin coconut oil and thing it is non-gmo certified it's gluten-free and it's vegan so yes so that is that 120 calories 120 calories it's three cups and that is 1.5 uh serve serving per Containing so here's I'm gonna try to get this clear. Hope y'all can see that right there. This is all what it is because it says organic, vegan, good source of fiber, less fat, more fiber, and fewer calories. So yeah, I hope y'all can see that. If not, I'll put um I'll list everything underneath. But yeah, this was good and like for a big bag like this, I was shocked to see that this was like two dollars and something at all these it was about two dollars i think 249 to something but that was that okay the other thing is i'm an ice cream person and everybody know i always get the lactate free ice cream but at all these i found some, another alternative for that if i want ice cream and i wanted to get it there this is where i would get it is called the sunday shop light and it is 115, 150 calories, three grams of, of fat, um, 65 um, of sodium, and 19 grams of sugar. And it's the vanilla light ice cream. And think it's pretty good. And it says made with milk from cows, not tested with RBTS. And thing, the ingredients looks pretty clean. Yeah, the ingredient, the ingredients in this one looks pretty clean and stuff. And so for the ice cream, I will um, list it, but I also will try to list the ingredients for the ice cream for y'all below and stuff. But overall, those are some things that I would repurchase. Now I waited to the last to show you the one thing that I wouldn't repurchase. I am a cheese stick fanatic. If it's a cheese stick, I like it. So I saw this a vegan cheese sticks and I said, let me just try and see how I like it. So this is the brand right here. It's called Earth Grown Vegan. And it's a mozzarella style cheese stick, vegan cheese content, um, vegan cheese coast, and golden breadcrumbs. 70 calories, 3 grams of trans fat, 150 um, 
grams of sodium and one gram of sugar. Okay, first and foremost, the taste is not on point. It's not on point because this is vegan cheese. It did I did not like the taste and thing. But overall, um, it's like one stick per package, and I think total of servings that it was up in here, it was 10 up in here. I've got no more than like three out at least and cooked it, cooked it in the microwave, warm it up in the microwave and then put it in the air fryer to let it cook. Um, overall, this is just something that I wouldn't repurchase again. But it's like, like I said, it is vegan and um, it's gluten free. So if you're gluten free or vegan, this probably you probably would like it. It's um, mozzarella style um, cheese sticks. But overall, this is just the only thing. Yes, let me just say the only thing I wouldn't repurchase. But that's all I have time for, y'all. Until then, I'm Alicia. Don't forget to thumb up this video, comment below, and subscribe to my channel. Bye.